Now in this video, I'm going to show you how to do your highlighter like a pro makeup artist. There are obviously many different ways of doing highlighter, but this technique is going to be the most natural, it's going to be really youthful, and it's really going to be flattering. To create my highlight, I'm going to use my Catrice Light Perfecting Primer Serum. So this is in color sunlight. Um, it's just a liquid, a liquid highlighter that I'll be using. You can use a cream or a powder, whatever you prefer. Got some on the back of my hand. I'm going to use a fluffy brush and just get a tiny bit of that product onto the fluffy brush. The reason why I'm using a fluffy brush is just because it's going to help me really just softly apply it without it being too heavy. So right now I've only got foundation on, quite a matte foundation. Um, I've got matte blush, everything else is matte on my face, so there's no highlight on my face. So to determine where we place our highlighter, we wanna see where does the light naturally catch our face the most. So when you turn your face and have a look at where are the most prominent areas that catches the light. Um, so let's look at that and start applying. I'm gonna start with this area here. So if I turn my face, I can see that majority of the highlight sits under here in that area and on this cheekbone here. It doesn't really fall much on my cheek there, so I'm just gonna focus on exactly where my natural highlight falls. The idea here is to be led by the light and led by our natural features on our face. If I grab some more of that, if we look here on the brow bone, so when I turn my face, you can see the really, really bright highlight sits here. So we'll apply some of that just here. So let's look at the brow bone. When I turn my face, you can see that as I turn it, the brightest area is here. So we're not gonna apply it all the way on the brow bone. We just wanna do a touch of it there. On the lips, if you have a look at this area here, where does most of the light fall? It actually falls on these little raised areas there. So we can apply that highlighter to there. Let's look at our chin. You can see the light does catch on the chin, but it's not here at the bottom. It's actually right up here. Just a little bit in there. It's not at the end of our chin. Do you guys see that? It's just here in the middle. Okay, so very, very softly. We don't have too much on the chin. And then most importantly, the nose. So obviously we all often see where the nose is highlighted right down the middle and there's like a little Rudolph red nose glow happening on the end. I'm not judging you, makeup is your expression, do what you wanna do. But if we really wanna have something that's really natural, youthful, um, and it's not gonna be distracting, if we look at the nose, where does most of the highlight sit? And most of the highlight actually sits on these outer edges. That is where the light is catching, and that is what makes it look really, really natural and glowy. This is a really good tip if you wanna do a healthy, bronzy beach makeup look as well. So we're just highlighting on these outer edges and not in the middle. And on the tip, I can do just a tiny bit. You can just see where the light catches there. Do a tiny, tiny bit over there. Let me do the other side. And that is our highlighting done. I've really taken what's already there and enhanced it. I've taken what my skin has already shown me. I've taken what the light has already shown me. I've taken what my contours of my face and the shape of my face has already shown me. And I've just enhanced it. I hope that helps.